You have a, you want to spin the wheel? Yeah, sure. All right. So, it doesn't, the rule is this, you spin it, but you got to answer the question truthfully. I All right, cool. So we brought out the, the wheel, guys. We're going to have her spin it. Oh, thank you. Go ahead, spin it. All right. And I'll read the question out to the people. Oh, okay. When's the last time a man made you cry? Um, I'd be lying if I said I remember because I don't really cry over men, y'all. I really don't. I oh, don't. Shit. I love myself, you know. <laughs> so you haven't cried? You can't even remember? <laughs> Fucking guy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. Weird, so okay, so you can't remember the last time you cried over a guy? No. Never. No. Okay, interesting. So, do you think? Yeah, women deserve to get paid as much as men. I feel like you should get paid for the work that you do, no matter oh. what it is. Okay. Like, there's, it doesn't matter whatever gender, whatever, whatever it is, you should get paid for what you do. If it takes a lot of effort, you need to get paid a lot because you're doing a lot, you know? Okay, all right. Interesting. I have a question for you. Would you have dinner with Hitler or have sex with a friend that's in a friend zone? Which one would you prefer? I wouldn't even think about it. I would rather have sex with a friend because okay. who wants to have a dinner with Hitler? Uh, Alright. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I, I don't think you'd want to get to know him a little bit. But no, right. no, <laughs> I, I don't. <laughs> Alright, thank you. Alright, take it easy. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. So, um, yeah, it's a bit lively. Right? So, you guys, so you guys, you guys can see. Um, Oh, so yeah, yeah, I was about to say, you melted, bro. You melted. So you don't die. <laughs> huh? Over here. But you're good. You want to spin the wheel? All right. The question is, hold on, hold on to this. Craziest thing that turns you on. There you go. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, my God. Who is it? Craziest um, thing that turns you on. Um, nice ears. Nice ears. That's a strange one. Sorry. What, do you like just rub them or something? Huh? Do you like rub them or something or what? No, uh, smart ass turns me on. A smart ass turns you on. <laughs> yeah. But how do, what does that have to do with his ears? <laughs> I don't know. Because smart people are good listeners. Okay, you mean his listening skills? Yes. Okay, okay. I thought you meant like physically his ears. Also. Okay. So do you like a big like Dumbo or small or what? No, just regular. regular. Not too small. No. Not too small. No. Okay. So you just want a regular. Yes. I got you. Okay, let's do something. Okay, you just she wants to spin it again. That one's not fun. Okay. Well, you're the one that likes ears. This question is: Have you ever turned down a guy you like so he could chase you? Hell yeah. You have. No means yes. No means yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> now, why'd you uh, why'd you want him to chase you? Because I'm Argentinian, and we need to say at least like three times no, so that we feel. Okay. Valuable. Have you ever? Have you ever turned them down and then they just didn't pursue you and they said, fuck this shit? And then you lost them? Yes. That's happened? Yeah. So you've lost good guys for playing games? Yeah. Damn. That sucks. How old are you? 37. God damn. I know. I should know better. Yeah. I know. Are you single now? <laughs> no. No? Okay, good. Good. So you so you gave one guy a chance at least? Yes. All right. Good. I, good, good. Cho I chose him. I pursued him. You pursued him? Yeah. How old were you when you pursued him? Well, I tell you guys, man, once they get a little bit older, they get wiser. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> All right, no worries. Bye. All right. Um, oh, is the backpack? The backpack's heavy as fuck, huh? Yeah. Okay. Um, here, Mo. Yo, is it possible? Nah, we can't. We can't do the mic, right? The other one. We can, but it's just gonna be. 
is going to come in from different ears. All right, fair enough. We can just tell people, hey guys, don't use that phone for this podcast. Fair enough. I guess I do. Yeah, 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 no, 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 you go, bro, take your time. Take your time. All right, so chat, I need you guys to join Castle Club. All right, I need you guys to join Castle Club. We're out here making good for you guys over last night. The quality should be better. The video should be immaculate. The audio should be immaculate. Shout out to Neil for helping us out behind the scenes. We end up calling those IRL people, getting things fixed up. So we're good money now. Um, but yeah, join Castle Club, guys. Help us uh, with, with the fight against censorship. And uh, also, yeah, party. It's scheduled for August 10th. For some of you guys that missed it, August 10th, August party. August 10th, yacht party. 350 spots. Speeds, seats are limited. We're going to have a bunch of girls there. So obviously, it's going to be mostly women. So we're only going to have, you know, maybe 100 or so spots for the guys. Um, it's going to be a good time. And the ticket pricing, we're able to lower it for you guys. It's only going to be 998 Open bar, free food, big mega yacht, 350 people, three to four uh, stories. It's going to be lit. It's going to be a good ass time. We travel on around Miami. Link in the Castle Club feed. Yep. What's the, link, the link is in the Should Castle Club feed. All right. Come on over. Let's spin the wheel. Let's see what happens. Okay. So I'll spin it for. Actually, you spin it. Go ahead. So. Okay. Okay. You know what? We uh, had that. That question came up. It was the craziest thing that turns you on. Well, let's spin it again. So we get something a little different. Yeah, why not? Yeah. I get bored of getting Okay. Have you ever turned down a guy you like so he could chase you? Okay, that's another question that came up. But have you ever turned down a guy that you like so just so he could chase you? Yes. You have? Okay, what ended up happening? Did he actually chase you or did you lose him? It's weird. I can't find the right combination. It's like you're testing everything. There's, what do you mean by that? I mean, right. like, I... I try to be helpful, I made myself available, being the right person. I've also tried, like, But you said you had him chase you, though. Um, some of them have, but it's just like... No, but the question is, know. have you purposely turned him down so you would want him to chase you? Yeah, you yeah. You have done that. So yeah. then, did they always pursue, or did someone just say, fuck it, and didn't pursue? It, it depends on the gave guy. Up. I, I don't know until I, ha until I do it, that's when I find out. Until I do that, then I figure out whether they do that or not. So each guy is different. Some of them have, some of them haven't. Okay. It's have you ever lost a good guy because you were playing games? You know, I lost guys because I haven't played games with them. It's, okay. it's strange. How old are you? Strange. I'm 31. 31. Yeah. Well, time sickened, man. Yeah, yeah, it really is. Time uh, sickened. I didn't know. I didn't know what to do. So I'm like, you know what? Um, sometimes if they, they're, I feel like I've seen like. If there's a good person there, whatnot, sometimes I feel like they get bored of that. Some, some, the way that I see it is some guys, once they're with somebody that treats them like a dog, they're happy. That's the woman that gets the man. So I just don't understand. Did you not do that? I, I've seen that. Did no, you not I've seen treat that. them well? Or? No, I, I treated them well and I guess they get bored of that, you know? You got bored of it. No, they got bored of it. They broke up with you? Yeah. yeah guys they, break they up get, with you? Yeah, they get bored That's of it. Rare. Okay, so, so here's the thing. You, you're not like a hammer, right? It's a tool. Yeah. It's a tool, right? Yeah. So we each have our own design. There's a design for the woman. There's a design of the man. Yeah. And sometimes if you're not uh, requiring so much of a man that is probably at the purpose of a man, maybe they get bored of you. You know, maybe they get bored of, like, they don't feel like... That's rare because guys don't usually leave girls just because they're bored. I, I don't understand. Unless like, they're that bored. I just don't understand. I feel like it's probably a societal washdown because some guys that doesn't happen to and some guys I feel like they need to be taught. So I just, I'm not understanding what's happening. It's just like, it's a whole change. Like the world is changing, especially here in this country. So I feel like we're pretty new to what's happening. And we're- So we you think dating is terrible right now? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Whose fault do you think it is that dating is terrible now, men or women? Both of us. I think both of us, I think that... Okay. Like, things Who do you are, think is the worst contributor? The worst contributor? Like a bigger contributor to the failure? Men or women? I think that what we're being born into, and huh? it just keeps getting worse. You think it's worse? what? What we're being born into, and it just keeps getting yeah, worse. Yeah, but if you have to pick one gender that's like offending worse to hurt dating, is it the men or the women, in your opinion? Okay, so I will have to bring this back, right? Because before, 
men had all the control and power. Yeah. And the thing is, like many holy books, right? Yeah. Many, many holy books, it's set up to be that way. But the thing is that when the men abuse it, that's when women try to scream for help, you know? When there's hurt, when there's domestic violence, when there's many things you can't do. But I'll do, say women right? control things now, though. Exactly. So that's when they had to be. But dating they sucks had now. To. They control things now. Dating Ex sucks. Exactly. So yes. who calls it then? Yes. So yes. It, it sucks. Dating sucks. So women then. But it wouldn't happen that way. Men didn't abuse their God-given power. Yes, their strength. Well, you guys have the um, power now. Not really. Not all over the world. No. It but is in America, chaos. women have the power when it comes to dating. It's, it's really, it's a chaos. I wouldn't really call it power. I feel like they're, they're still figuring it out. It's brand new. It's brand new. For them to say, okay, this has to be this way and it's correct, I would say that's even wrong because... I think women have the power and you guys fucked it up, if I'm going to be all honest. I think you guys fucked it up. And I'll tell you why. Okay, well, can you let me finish? I'll hear you. But let sure, me finish, ahead. right? I feel like men had centuries and centuries and centuries. So for them to have this where, it, like, women broke off, it, it was a feeling. It was real reasons. So now I do feel like I, I do feel better when when men represent women because I've been disrespected by other men, and when I have a man with me, I feel like I'm more respected. Okay. And I feel like it's very necessary. We need each other, right? We need each other. But women are so new to this role that for you to for women or even men to write down guidelines, it has to be this way. It's too new. We're, too, we're still testing it out, and it's obviously not working out. And we change it back to the other way. There has to be some guidelines of okay, this can just not happen. This cannot happen. I'm completely comfortable with like. You're very good at yapping. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank <Link. laughs> you. You're very good at yapping. I'm just like holy crap. Well, thank you. Like I'm very comfortable for me to have like a confident man, you know, who, who would take lead on things, and for me to take lead on things that I'm supposed to do. But the thing is, it's becoming hard, just economically. So you want the men in power? Were you just complaining about it a second ago, saying they're no, no, power? No, 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 no. Here's the thing: women fought for the ability to make a choice, right? Yeah. If I want to choose to have a career, do all these things, I can do it. But if I want to choose to, you know, take care of family, which is important, because I don't trust a lot of the nut jobs out here, then I can do that. It's, it's supposed to be a choice, right? I think careers for women is pointless. Careers? For women is pointless. It's true. You know why? You agree? I agree because the education system here is a scam. It's a scam for men and women. They, you pay hundreds of thousands of dollars to go to school. You take a lot of classes you don't need. It's yep. the only valuable time for the man that he can go out there, make a career, make money, and advance himself in the corporate ladder. And at the same time, it steals the golden years for women. Okay. All we do is go to college, we pile on all this So you believe it's a scam too? It's a scam. Okay. You it should be college? punished. Did you go to college? Some college. You did, okay, you didn't finish? Okay. But yeah, only out of the, the four classes that I had, only one class had to do with my major. And then next thing you know, I had to pay $10,000. Oh. So they so still... So you said, fuck this. It's a valuable time for me, my body, making a family, or being able to succeed in a well, career. You better get on it if you want a family. Exactly. Yeah. 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 Like, most yeah. of your eggs are gone now. No offense. It's true. Yeah. It's true. I mean, we're speaking Like, what, like, after 30 years old, a woman, like, 80% of a woman's eggs are gone? No. Yeah. Maybe. So, well, the really? uh, majority are gone. Really? Majority are gone by the time you're 30, yeah. Yeah, exactly. So, uh, that's why in some countries, this is it, it's even... It should, it should even be criminal here to make people waste time um, here, spending yeah, money. This is what we'll do. Uh -huh. you, you go find a man. We're going to continue the stream. <laughs> all right? You go find a guy because your time is ticking. All right? But thank you so much. What's your name? Tell the people what's your name. Senny. 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 Okay, yes. thank you for coming. Yeah, we, we need to be open-minded. Sure, you sure. Know? sure. Um, Hopefully the, you find a guy. No, and the way that I see it, in some places, it's, it's criminal. Uh, some of the things that we do here, and the thing is, it's working for them. It's really working for them. I think it should be criminal that, that if you didn't have to take all these BS classes in college, maybe you would do three years of college, you'll be allowed oh, okay, that yeah. debt, you'll over. get yourself ahead. Right. Men can be more providers, you okay. know. Uh, we can help each other as a team, but this okay, is not working. Cool. Yeah. All right. Hey. Thank you. Thank you. Right, you. Um, hello, how are you? What's your name? Sam. Yeah, no, the police have seen us here before. That's what they're saying. What is that? Oh, you saw the police. That's right away. My boss, my boss. We're not done. 
Bro. Huh? Yeah, you do? Okay. All right, so, okay. Um, okay, so, uh, what's your name? Sav. What is it? Sav, S-A-V. Sav? Real Shay Sav, S-A-V. Oh, good to see you again. Yeah, how are you're, you? I almost didn't recognize you. Yeah, you know. You're like super tan right now. Oh my God, good. I've been working on it. So, uh, oh, you got your friend here with you. Yeah. You want to come by and say what's up, too? Oh, my crap, what are you, like, 4'10"? 4'11". 4'11"? Yeah. They call me Big China. Big they call China. you Big China? Not yeah. the little one. <laughs> That's an interesting nickname. Yeah. Big China. Big China, the biggest. Big China. Big China. Big China. Big China. Yeah, that's actually, like, a funny name. Nah, we're not actually big. You don't know what we say, big. Okay. And uh, I'm assuming you're from China? Okay. Yeah. So what do you guys do? Um, I have a salon in Jersey. So I you have a salon in Jersey? You're yeah. Visiting? You're and a I'm a jeweler. You're what? A jeweler. A jeweler. Yes. Okay. Uh, okay, so you switch things up. Yeah. And how did you guys meet? Uh, we actually just from me coming out from Miami. Yeah. Outside, we know? met in Miami. You guys met in Miami? Yeah. While outside? Yeah. <laughs> Translation, you guys met at a club or a bar or something? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah, whenever girls use the term outside, it's all typically that's what Outside, it means. not in. Okay. Interesting. Um, yeah, so Big China, um, you do realize, yeah, I know, it's kind of a funny name. Do you have a handicap sticker? Because at like 410, you can literally get a handicap sticker. Oh my gosh. Not one bro, inch was, over, though. Oh, inch she's over, an yeah. inch over. Like, technically, I'm like an inch and a half over. Oh, what, you got to be 410? I think so. For under 410. Oh, because then you get a handicap sticker. I would get one of those and I can just park in the front. No, but you know what? If you think about it, though, like, they're not paying those people that much money to actually look around the parking lot. I feel like you don't actually get tickets for that. You? Out here, they be ticketing. Oh, well, where I live, I always park in a handicap. I never got a ticket in there. You said Jersey? Yeah, Jersey. Okay. Well, no one lives there, so I understand. Uh, Oh, yeah, you can take the handicap spots. So, yeah. Uh, Cool. Did you guys want to spin the wheel? Yeah. All right, we could do a spin the wheel with you guys real quick. And round and round we go. All right. Uh, okay. Craziest thing that turns you on. Um, crazy. I don't know if this is crazy. Felony conviction? No, that uh-huh. turns me on. What about you? When they don't have kids. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's when, they when, they kids. Kids? when yeah. they don't have kids. When they don't have kids? When they don't have kids, that's a turn on. Every dude you deal with has kids? I didn't, I didn't say that. I said when well, they don't have kids. I'm but is that on. common that you deal with a guy that has kids? Uh, no comment. No comment. No comment. Oh, shit. What's up, man? Okay. And I don't know if this is crazy, but like good hygiene. Good hygiene. Okay. Yeah. That's, yeah. That's a, that's a standard. Would you guys say that a majority of men or a, a sizable portion have bad hygiene? Honestly, no. One no? thing that I can <laughs> One thing I can say, I feel like I meet more men, like more men that uh, have like clean apartments and you know have good hygiene than women. Yeah. Really? Yeah. yeah. Okay, that's good. I mean, most of the people. We're making the change, guys. Try to deal with. Because one of the biggest complaints we get from women is that guys are dirty. It just depends what kind of man you're messing with. Like, okay. if, if that's your standards, then shit. I don't know, but it's not mine. All right. Well, ladies, yeah. thank you for your time. Appreciate thank it. You. Let you guys go on your yeah. way and do your thing. Take care. Bye. What the heck? Someone threw like a weird. Yeah, look. From up there. Is this your new dog? It's a big DJ. Appreciate it. Hi, how are you? Oh, you just want to say what's up? Okay. Um, he wants to go down. He wants to what? Bro, we've never had pause before. Where's. How are you, baby? I'm good. You know what this is, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't recognize her at first because she's so. I didn't recognize you with the hair, too. 